turtle, also referred as the cosmic turtle or the world bearing turtle, is a theory of a giant tortoise supporting or containing the world. The theory, which is similar to that of the world elephant and the world serpent, occurs in Hindu Vedic texts, Chinese mythology, and the mythologies of the indigenous peoples of the America. The world tortoise in Hindu Vedic texts is also known as Akubara or sometimes Chukra. An example of a reference to the world tortoise in Hindu literature is found in Nanaraja. This literature says, a vulture, whichever has only little strength, rests in the sky, holding a snake in its beak or a peher, that is, three eyes. Why can the deity in the form of a tortoise, who possesses an inconceivable potency, not hold the earth in the sky for a kalpa, that is, billions of years? A well-known scientist. Bertrand Russell once gave a public lecture on astronomy. He described how the Earth orbits around the Sun and how the Sun in turn orbits around the center of a vast collection of stars called our galaxy. At the end of the lecture, a little old lady at the back of the room got up and said, What you have told us is rubbish. The world is really a flat plate supported on the back of a giant tortoise. The scientist gave a superior smile before replying, What is the tortoise standing on? You are very clever young man, very very clever, said the old lady. But it's turtles all the way down. Turtles all the way down is an expression of the problem of infinite rigorous. The saying alludes to the Hindu Vedic idea of a world tortoise that supports the earth on its back. It suggests that this turtle rests on the back of an even larger turtle which itself is a part of a column of increasingly large world turtles that continues indefinitely. That is, turtles all the way down. The exact origin of the phrase is uncertain. In the form rocks all the way down, the saying appears as early as 1838. References to the saying's mythological antecedents, the world tortoise and its counterpart, the world elephant, were made by a number of authors in the 17th and 18th centuries. This theory is frequently assumed to have originated in ancient India and other Hinduism beliefs. In the book Researches into the Early History of Mankind and the Development of Civilization, the turn of the 20th century, anthropologist Edward Burnett Tyler writes that the world tortoise concept likely first appeared in the Hindu Vedic text. In one Vedic story, the form of the god Vishnu's second avatar, Kurma, is a great tortoise which provides a celestial foundation upon which a mountain is balanced. Another popular belief says that the earth rests on the head of a serpent, Sinaga. Earthquakes are supposed to take place when the tortoise or the serpent moves. The origin of the serpent theory is the story of a serpent, Vitra. Like most of the beliefs of the Hindus, the origin of this theory can also be traced to the Vedas. As per Rig Veda, heaven is fierce and the earth is firm due to him. We should note here that firm here is used in the sense of being very hard and not as stationary. Heaven is fierce because it is the abode of energy and earth that is Prithvi is firm because it is the abode of particles which do not have wave-like characteristics. Prithvi is considered like a tortoise in Vedic scriptures. Tortoise has a very firm back without any hair on it. Observer space that is 
Prithvi is firm like the back of tortoise and it does not have hair as well. As per the Aitareya Brahmana, this Prithvi was without hair earlier. This Prithvi is like the back of the tortoise. Hair refers to the field lines. Even modern physicians use similar analogy when they say that black holes do not have hair, meaning that the field lines cannot emerge from a black hole. Prithvi does not have hair because hair is a characteristic of the field and the field resides in Antarya. The Vedic ideas were picked up by Semitic religions without having any clue as to the real scientific meaning behind these ideas. The Bible also says that the earth was bald earlier in Genesis. In India, massive efforts were made to preserve the scientific meaning of the Vedas. Still, the analogy between Prithvi and the back of the tortoise was forgotten long time back. And then a theory generated which supports that the earth rests on the back of a giant tortoise and earthquakes takes place when the tortoise turns. For more interesting videos like this, subscribe to our YouTube channel Science Mysteries. Goodbye for now.